Hey guys, here I am, not in my house, I'm in my hotel, and I'm a little out of breath because frankly, I have uh, probably, I think another 30 minutes of my workout to do. Um, but there's two things I wanted to do. Number one, Mr. Flow, Mr. Flow, I don't know if you can see, but there's a little bit of sweat going on. I don't know if you can even tell. I didn't mean to just put my boobs in the camera, I really didn't. Um, this lighting kind of makes me look red. I hope it doesn't turn out that way. Um, but I'm in my hotel room and it's very odd to do uh, vlogs in your hotel room because you have like natural light out and then the lights in this hotel room, which are very Parisian. Um, they're just like, there's no light in the middle of the room. So I can't really show you what I'm doing, but I wanted to try, I'm trying to do vlogs here in Vegas. Um, while I'm here, I'm here for like five days and I want to try to shoot this is a challenge for someone like me, to shoot vlogs that are like, let's try to go for like three minutes. So I'm already at one. I'll try to shoot more vlogs, less time, because then that way I can upload them and give you video stuff while I'm here. So I just wanted to let you know that last night, um, you know, when you fly to Vegas from the Midwest, it's like a four hour flight. So, and then you add airport time and whatever, you're basically flying all day. And, um, I have a big jug of water downstairs, which I'm just going to refill. Yes. Um, but anyway, I'll show you in just a second what I pack for the room. So I've got, just to show you, and, and this, you guys, even though I'm doing this workout here in my hotel room, and I brought my DVDs, I'm doing the fine Tony Horton today, kind of drooling all over the laptop, because he is my future ex-husband. He just doesn't know it yet. Um, but you can bring just a few DVDs, just a few pieces of equipment, of course, you can buy this at Sears, among 5,000 other things that I've added to my wish list. Um, but you can do a workout in your hotel room if the hotel doesn't have a gym or if the gym has um, just a bunch of crowds or creepy men with a lot of body hair that you want to avoid. That's usually my case. So um, anyway, got in here last night. I'm creeping up on three minutes. Um, I was exhausted. You guys, I just kind of realized once I went to bed last night that like the, the toll of like life stress, you know, there was a baby delivery. Okay, I have, you know, I have a new nephew. Um, I had the death of a friend, a burial of a friend, a lot of, you know, crazy work stuff going on and then travel and just like a whole lot of stuff in the period of one week. And all of that added together equals no sleep and I was exhausted. So I had planned to get in and do a workout, but by the time I got to my hotel room, I think it was 5.30, 6 o'clock and I hadn't eaten. I just had trail mix on the plane. Um, so all that to say is I got in, I went out for dinner, had some sushi. I'm going to talk about that later because I'm beginning to think, Sarah, I think you and I are starting to have a lot of the same things. Tummy issues. Got to keep it simple. Anyway, I'm not trying to rap, but I just did. <sighs> so anyway, I got up today and um, wanted to squeeze my workout in. I didn't feel like going to the hotel gym. I don't know why, I, I, but I got to tell you guys, I woke up this morning and I was so, so tired. Okay. I slept in. I didn't get up at five in the morning. But I slept in and I was just, it felt so good to be so rested that there was part of me that was like, I just didn't feel like working out. And then I made myself get dressed. I made myself have my breakfast. I had egg beaters for the first time today. Talk about that later. It was awesome. Um, but I had a healthy breakfast, um, got my mojo on, got some work done, and now I'm doing my workout and I feel flipping great. And the other thing is, I'm looking here in this mirror behind me. It's where I'm working out in front of, because I don't know if you can see, but I have kind of a big space there to work out in, which is nice. Even if you don't have big space, this lighting is bizarre. You can still work out in your hotel room. I'm only whispering because who knows if the people next to me are trying to sleep and they're probably like certain finger gestures. My heart rate's going down. I'm already, can you see that? I'm already at 384 and I probably have another half an hour to go. So this should be like a 500 um, calorie burn workout. And what I did is I started off with Kathy HIIT workout, her 30-30, and then I'm doing Tony Horton um, Road Warrior workout, which is primarily all this. And let me tell you, I learned some new moves on this thing that, pff, holy cow, I'm gonna have the doms tomorrow. Um, but anyway, all that to say, number one, half the time you're not gonna feel like it, do something that is gonna help you just start because for me, once I start, I'm, I'm owning it and I'm just so proud that I'm starting that I'm just going to do it. And then um, number two, I have to say it helped me to be looking in the mirror and I could see that I lost weight. And my friend last night saw me and she said that she could see that I lost weight and you know, I don't know, 
You all know, that's like a great feeling. So I'm at five minutes, I'm gonna go. Enjoy Wednesday Woot Factor. I promise to do another video later. Let's see how this works. Peace out, bye.